Alright guys, it is a flat out spectacularly gorgeous day here in the end times in paradise. Here in uh, Cedar Creek, Texas. Little dog, are you? Little dog got some hot, got some hot peppers on the on the throat here. We've been enjoying our tacos at the Mi Barrio Taqueria under the Exxon sign. Two dollars and nine cents for gas at Exxon. So I love it. We have the propane truck. The uh, propane truck gassing up at the Exxon. <clears throat> you know, under the uh, under the shadow of the cell phone tower. There you go. We have the propane truck gassing up at Exxon under the cell phone tower next to the Mi Barrio taco wagon. Yep. So uh, anyway, I'm off on another excursion into the end times. My God, this new high school, the Cedar Creek High School. Looks like a cross between a FEMA camp and the University of Texas. Good God Almighty. Cedar Creek, Texas. Starting to uh, look a little bit too much like Austin, Texas. So let me get back out on the racetrack known as Highway 71. So we're going into. Uh, I want to avoid going into Austin, Texas, so I have chosen the lesser of two evils. The town of Bastrop, Texas. I think the only video I've ever brought you from Bastrop, Texas was my first Bucky's video. I think they built this Bucky's Super 7-Eleven out of here. Uh, three or four years ago uh, but I'm not heading to Bucky's I am heading to the Department of Public Safety the Texas Department of Public Safety to get my new driver's license I am uh, heading into the the eye of the tiger as it were uh, you know, to play this fucking game that I'm playing with the IRS, that I need to make my little, uh, there's the Bucky sign right now. All right, we got the Bucky sign. Number one and number two, the two best reasons to visit Bucky's. Yes, I think uh, certainly the number two reason to shit on Bucky's is an excellent reason to uh, go to Bucky's is to shit on Bucky's. But anyway, uh, as I say, I'm not going to shit on Bucky's. I'm going to be shit on by the great state of Texas and uh, the driver's license bureau, hoping that I can uh, <coughs> uh, miss some of the crowds in Austin. We'll see how long this takes me to get through. Now, I could do this whole fucking thing online. Uh, the reason that I can't do it online is because I don't have a damn printer to print out my temporary driver's license reflecting my new address in Garfield. So, I have to have this driver's license for two years to prove that, uh, this place in Garfield is my primary residence. This is what this whole thing is about. Uh, this whole little charade I'm playing with uh, with the Internal Revenue Service. Because if you go two years to something as your primary residence, then you don't have to pay the capital gains tax. So I'm sitting here uh, trying to save about $20,000 the IRS. But of course what this means now is I need to make it through two more hurricane seasons, two more flood seasons on my little house in the floodplain. 
Uh, so as long as uh, A, I can squeak by without a hurricane, B, squeak by without some other flood, C, squeak by without an economic collapse, maybe I can make it two fucking years. Uh, you know, the, the whole point was to get this place sold before hurricane season. And now I've got to go through hurricane season 2018 and hurricane season 2019. There, there's a thought. 2019. Uh, good God. Now, I was just reading yesterday in my uh, climate change meltdown roundup ramp about how more and more people are starting to factor in climate change uh, into their home purchases. No shit, Sherlock. Uh, talking about how the flood maps are being expanded in preparation. My, say my, my house is already in a fucking floodplain. Has been since they ever did the first floodplain. I'm in what's called a 100 year floodplain. It, well, the last time, I understand from the old timers, the last time that there was a big flood and where my house would have been underwater was sometime in the 1920s. Well, it's 2018 and my house has been sitting there since 1974 and it hasn't gone underwater yet. But of course, the, the very concept of a, of a 100 year floodplain uh, in the state of Texas in the year 2018 is patently absurd. Needless to say, I, I, not only do I have no flood insurance, I don't have one penny of insurance on that place. All right, we have another billboard for, uh, for Bucky's out. This was a poor placement in signage. So they just had a billboard saying number one and number two, the two best reasons to go for to Bucky's. And then one minute later, they have a sign for Bucky's advertising fudge, advertising homemade fudge. One, uh, one minute after saying the best reason to go to Bucky's is to take a shit. I don't know, that wasn't the best planning, in my opinion, on the on that placement of those two signs. Uh, but anyway, I'm not here to talk about Bucky's. I'm here to talk about the collapse of a fucking planet and uh, trying to squeak by two more years w without my damn house floating away. And, uh, in a damn flood or hurricane and then we'll see what my house is worth so in an effort to, to save uh, 20,000 I'll watch 150,000 disappear down the fucking river okay we're coming into the great town of Bastrop Texas great town of Bastrop Texas where we have the giant American flag uh, flapping over the Home Depot, which is right directly across the street from the Lowe's, which of course is my other reason for uh, coming to Bastrop, Texas today, is to take back the first door that I bought at, uh, at Lowe's. So we've got Home Depot on one side, Lowe's on the other side with the McCoy's building center in between. All right, we got the Jiffy Lube next to the discount tire, next to the single biggest American flag I have ever seen. What is, oh, it's flying over the Chevy dealership. There you go. I wish you guys could see this fucking thing. Let you know these are American cars. These are American cars. So the Chevy dealership is under the flapping American flag is uh, between the Chinese buffet and the Taco Cabana. 
I cannot think of a better place to fly an American flag than between a Chinese and a Mexican restaurant in, uh, in the great state of Texas. Uh, so anyway, as I was saying about, so I'm going to the goddamn uh, playing this fucking game with the police state at the Texas Department of Public Safety. <laughs> Public Safety. Oh yeah. And then heading back to uh, to Lowe's to go back. Uh, this is my third trip to Lowe's in three days. First I had to buy the door which I decided was the wrong door. Then I had to go, then I was in Austin yesterday, so I went to another Lowe's to buy a bigger door. And now I gotta go back to Lowe's a third time to take back the first door. So I have probably, between the three doors, I have uh, used about a gallon, a, a gallon, right? a tank of gas in my gas sucking truck. Uh, of course, I'm not exactly sure where the fucking driver's license bureau is in Bastrop, Texas. Bastrop, Texas, I think for a few years, a, a little while back there in the 90s, Bastrop, Texas might have been the single fastest growing town. I can't remember, was it Texas or was it the United States of America? that uh, Bastrop was the biggest uh, well fuck guys I don't know uh, I don't know where the fuck uh, the driver's license bureau is I'm gonna go down this way and we're gonna go see if there's a driver's License Bureau behind the Harry Butts behind the Harry Butts grocery store. I know I need to go in the Harry Butts grocery store. Oh God. Just another fucking day. Just another fucking day in the end times, guys. Uh, it's just it's just business as usual. You know, it is another day on the damn planet. Just uh, eating my tacos, stopping at Exxon, uh, dealing with the police state, going to fucking Lowe's Building Supply Center for three times in three days. Uh, thinking about my house floating down the fucking Colorado River in the goddamn global superstorm building on this planet. And of course, uh, thinking about my damn YouTube channel being taken down. Uh, good God. There's more and more and more uh, information coming up on this YouTube purge. Uh, I guess Alex, I, it's unclear whether Alex Jones has one or two strikes against him. I. I'm hearing differing reports on whether or not strike two was erased or not. Uh, so I don't know what's going on with my buddy Alex Jones today. You know, and for the record, guys, as much as I despise Alex Jones, the only thing I despise more than Alex Jones are these little fucking cops at uh, YouTube deciding what uh, we should be able to be allowed to hear, and, you know, protecting our goddamn innocent little ears from anyone from Alex Jones to, uh, to Hambone Little Tail. Uh, it's, a, you know, it's a bunch of goddamn shit. If you don't have the fucking brains and the, and the discernment and critical thinking ability to listen to goddamn Alex Jones, and, and, and know what a fucking jackass he is. Uh, what, what's a little censorship uh, going to do to change that? I have, where the fuck is the driver's license bureau? Uh, 
There's the Texas Farm Bureau. Maybe it's somewhere around here. Good God Almighty. Yeah, this, uh, this, this YouTube censorship is no joke. So I think, I never can remember how to pronounce this guy's channel, Brother Max. Brother Max hopefully is to the rescue. So now, not only am I making a bunch of channels elsewhere, I'm, uh, I'm, uh, I think I'm going to make these, the Sancho Ponza channel, uh, here on YouTube as a, uh, as a backup channel for Humpty Dumpty Tribe. I'm not a hundred percent sure of that, but I think what we're going to do is, uh, is have a backup YouTube channel. So maybe these fuckers can't get us. All right, we're at the Texas Department of Public Safety. But of course, the only parking here is for employees of the Texas Department of Public Safety. God damn, how I many you know I thought I was going to come here to escape the fucking line in Austin and God every motherfucking every parking place can I squeeze into this thing not really I gotta try to here it is March 1st and I already need to start looking for uh, shade for Sancho Panza employee parking employee parking employee parking good fucking God Anyway, I'm off to deal with the Texas police state. You're going to have to sit in the car, little dog. March 1st, and it's already time to start looking for that sunshade so I don't have to Sancho in the goddamn hot Texas sun. Oh, God. Another fucking day in the end times. This is your old depressed collapsitarian and his little dog. Smoke him if you got him. We're so fucked. <laughs> 